Today's story is about an English mathematician, physicist, and a brewer. A scientist who linked between the heat concept and the mechanical work and hence the formulation of the first law of thermodynamics. By such discovery, his name was named after the energy measurement unit. In short, he is James Prescott Joule. On New Bailey Street in Salford, James Jewell was born in 1818. He is the son of Benjamin Jewell and Alice Prescott where his father was a rich brewer. Jewell was affected by the ideas of the chemist William Henry and some engineers from Manchester when he was young. In 1835, Jewell studied at the University of Manchester alongside the English chemist John Dalton electromagnetic engines and their strengths and drawbacks in comparison to steam engines were among Joule's initial scientific concerns. His involvement with the family brewery helped him to focus his attention on engines that increase productivity. Joule was focusing on the management of his father's brewery where later he improved his father's business by replacing the steam engines with a new electric motor that he built. In 1840, Joule published a paper describing the Joule law stating that the quantity of heat generated per second in a wire carrying a current is proportional to the wire's electrical resistance and the square of the current. As a result of that, the SI unit of work was named after him. In 1843, he did a famous experiment that proved that heat is a type of mechanical energy. In 1845, he delivered his paper on the mechanical equivalent of heat to the British Association in Cambridge. Joule computed the mechanical equivalent of heat as 4.1868 joules per calorie of effort to raise the temperature of one gram of water by one Kelvin. Joule received honorary degrees from Trinity College Dublin in the year of 1857, the University of Oxford in the year of 1860, and the University of Edinburgh in the year of 1871. In 1878, Joule was awarded a civil list pension of 200 pounds per year for his contributions to science. In the year of 1854 his wife and infant son died. He never married after this traumatic incident. Joule became very ill in his last few years of his life. To keep himself going, he relied on a well-earned salary from the British government. Jewell died on October 11, 1889 in Sale and is buried in the Brooklyn's graveyard with the number 772.55 written on the grave headstone. This number refers to one of his discoveries which is the climacteric 1878 measurement of the mechanical equivalent of heat. That was a brief biography of the English physicist and mathematician, James Joule. We hope that you enjoyed it. More stories will be covered, so ensure that you're subscribed and click the bell icon. Please help us by liking, commenting and sharing. This encourages us to deliver more. Wait for the next video on the Electricity and Magnetism channel, and we'll see you in the next one.